Ah, there you are, dinky do everybody. It's just me, Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, and we're live on Periscope, the world's top broadcast platform. Now, we have lots to talk about today, so I hope you'll get yourself sorted out. The comments are on, so I shall be expecting your comments. I'm looking for quality comments, of course, so we're looking for the best of everything from you. This program is for highly intelligent people. I am the world's top broadcaster. I can offer you 36,000 hours of live unscripted broadcasting just for you saying dinky do. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good to have you with us. And of course, I look forward to your comments. Now, what we're talking about today is should America come home to mama? All right. Should America come home to mama? So there we are. It looks like America is struggling to find its identity. All right, you've got a new president, and some of you agree with them, some of you don't agree with them. But of course, when one looks at the alternative that you could have had, one thinks, well, are we better with what we've got? Who knows? That's not the question, though. As America seems to be flapping in the wind in terms of identity, would it be better to go back to its roots? Now, in 1776, we in the United Kingdom of Great Britain gave America its independence, right? We granted America its independence. All right, so there was a skirmish for it. But at the end of the day, King George granted America its independence, its freedom. Although now, is it starting, as I say, to flap in the wind like an old flag? So there we are. So do tell us what you think. Should America come back and join this time Scotland? The Scottish government is known the world over as the most stable and finest government that has ever existed. It's doing a wonderful, wonderful job for Scotland, and I think it would definitely tie in with America. So the question I'm asking today is, would you come home to Mama? Mama being Scotland. Would you come and be governed by Scotland? Would you come and have the high standards of government that Scotland has? So there we are. We aren't destroying our history. There are monuments that some believe, people believe to be symbols of oppression. Well, this is me raising oppression. So you will never have oppression. You will never be oppressed if you are part of Scotland. Scotland has suffered oppression for 310 years. That's all about to finish as it gains its freedom from Westminster, from the United Kingdom. and. At that stage, we will say to America, would you like to join us? Why not? So there you are. Nicola Sturgeon for president is what we're getting here. Yes, absolutely. I think that is a first class idea because Nicola Sturgeon is doing a superb job in Scotland. Therefore, it would be great to roll this concept out right across America. Now, I've got 55,000 hearts. Can we make that more? I should have millions of hearts by now. So if you're watching right now, can you start tap, 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 de tap, tap, de tap, de tap on your screens as quickly as possible. See how soon we can get to one million hearts. If you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, live on Periscope on television. This is the finest show you will ever get anywhere in the globe's media. So enjoy it, enjoy it, enjoy it, and spread the word. Tell everyone, tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 about Scotty McClue broadcasting live on Periscope, one of the world's great broadcast platforms. Now, so much to talk about. Today we're talking about should America come home to MoMA? All right. Do you read these? Yes, of course I read these. I'm reading them all the time. So keep your comments going. Let's have them. Let's have some good quality stuff. Remember, this is a program for the intelligentsia. So if you are an idiot, please keep well clear. We don't 
tolerate idiots. This is for intelligent people who have got something to say. All right. So there you are, the Scotty McClure, the finest talk show in the world, and it's for people who have got very fine talk. So let's have some talk. Um, isn't Trump part Scottish? Yes, 50% Scottish. His mother uh, was Scottish. So there you are. Uh, excellent stuff. So do come on and join us. And um, as I say, it's early morning in the United States. America's the best country. Why do we want to join England? You don't have to join England. We're talking about you joining Scotland, your motherland. So there we are. His gran, was it not? No, I thought it was his mother. Was it his grandmother? So there you are. Who likes Trump? Not. Well, come on. A lot of people like him. Uh, America voted for him, so he must be a good guy. Wait there, Scotty. The nurse will be there soon. Thank you very much. Very much appreciated. But... We are talking sense. I speak verity on here. My president is Obama. Now, Obama, a lovely, lovely, lovely guy. Mrs. Obama, a lovely, lovely lady. Potters and floaters of some time ago now, but they've actually gone from the White House. It's Donald Trump now. So there you go. Hi from Saudi Arabia. Hi to you from Saudi Arabia. Hi from the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Love to Saudi Arabia, I say, to all our friends in the Middle East. And dinky-doo from Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, just for you. Nice to see you. Very nice to see you. Excellent stuff. So there you are. Trump will be impeached or he will resign. I don't think so. I can't see any reason for that. So there we go. Uh, there's somebody said, a swearing word, we'll just have to ban you. Uh, so there we are. Remember, any crude language, anything uh, too cheeky or what have you, and it's a lifetime ban for you from the Scotty McClue Show. Bye-bye. Ta-ta. All that. Is there enough work for the Yanks in Scotland? No, no, we're joining the two countries. It's just that Scotland would be governing America. That's all I'm saying. You don't have to be a huge country to provide very high quality government. And the Scottish government is the best in the world. So there we are. Uh, do let me know. Give me your comments. If you've just joined us, a very warm welcome, of course. You're watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster. It's just a quick periscope pop-up. Um, I know Trump is in the White House. Well, why did you say Obama is the president then? So there you go. I don't call him my president. Well, you'll have to do because he calls you his fellow American. So you've got to sort yourself out, chummy. There you go. Uh, right, if you've just joined us, as I say, a very warm welcome, Scotty McClure. Uh, who will build the tunnel between them? There's no need for a tunnel between them. We have the transatlantic cable that I think was laid in 1876, 100 years after independence was granted. So there you are. Well, Trump is half Scottish. Yes, I thought so. Yo, Scotty. Yo to you yourself. Tell us where you're watching throughout the world. Of course, very, very important. This is a global show. We are multi-international. And um, I will expect to hear from people right across the world. I know America's just waking up. But get the message, say, Scotty McClure is discussing you right now. I said Obama is my president right now. Uh, so there you are. Tip, uh, ball of malt, Scotty. Lovely. You like your whiskey man, are you? Excellent stuff. So there we are. Uh, sorry, you'll have to go. There we are. Swearing. We don't have swearing. Blocked. Gone. You'll never, ever, ever hear that person on the Scotty McClue show again. I've just blocked them for foul language. Ardbeg. Yes, we know Ardbeg. Excellent. Lovely to have you. From our big dinky doo, from me, Scotty McClue. Welcome to the Scotty McClue Show. This, of course, is the big one, the one everyone's talking about, the one everyone is watching. Scotty McClue is single handedly changing the way we watch and consume television. What about that? I've always been a market leader. I've always been first to the post. Before there was an internet, we were doing public access radio, interactive radio. So there we are. What we're talking about today is, does America want to come home to mama? It looks like America is flapping in the wind a little bit at the moment. It seems it's not governable at the moment. 
and I'm offering you an, a concept of coming home to Scotland. So there you are. So just a short time ago, 1776, America was British, right? And then King George granted America independence after a skirmish or two. So there you are. But what I'm saying is, is it time for America to come home to Mama? Uh, so there you go. Excellent stuff. America's Mama is Scotland, I would say. That's the best bet, guys. So think about twinning up with Scotland because the United Kingdom, because of all this Brexit, will end up breaking up. So there you go. We may even have a united Ireland. I don't know what you think about that. Very interesting. We most certainly will have an independent Scotland. And um, I would think that uh, big counties like Lancashire and Yorkshire and the Midlands might want to do something. Okay, Scotland, let's do it. So there you are. Excellent. Good idea. Thank you very much for your agreement. I think that is quality stuff. Can I have some hearts, please? I've only got 55,000 hearts. Come on. Hearts, 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 hearts. Tap, 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 tap. Bit more. Come on. Every single one of you. Tap, 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 tap. Now, we did a broadcast yesterday, and it's up in the thousands already. So there you go. So don't worry if you're just seeing small numbers watching, because everybody comes and join us once they realize Scotty McCrew is on. Everyone comes and joins us. Remember, most of your television and the bulk of your radio is pretty naff these days. You don't have the big talk shows like we used to have. And I think, certainly in the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland, we should have the Scotty McClure National Phone-In. We can do it on radio or on television. I would like to see this programme live on television for, say, half an hour every evening so that we can all join in. <clears throat> What's the plan? The plan is that we say to the Scottish Government, would you like America in your portfolio? And um, they take over the government. Now, I know that might mean moving into the White House or whatever, or having American attaches and representatives. But we would find a way, because the Scottish government is right at this moment the finest government in the world. Public access television in America, absolutely. I, I am the father of public access television. I am the father of public access radio. We have taken it to incredible limits, and we still haven't scratched the surface. It can go a tremendous amount further, I can tell you. I think it'd be better if we Scots went to America. There's only one T in Scots. Scots was a great shipyard in the west of Scotland, and they went in with Lithgow's Scott Lithgow, and they were known as Scots. But um, there's only one T in Scots, so S-C-O-T-S will suffice for Scots. If you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster. Uh, is it okay to rebroadcast your Periscope in America? Of course it is. Rebroadcast it anywhere. Get on to YouTube and check out the Scotty McClue channel. Come and subscribe on the YouTube channel. We need about another, I think it was 10 or 15 subscribers. And uh, 300,000 have actually seen Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. 300,000 people. That's not bad. And uh, it's not been around that long, I can tell you. So put your Scotty McClue, capital S, small c, O double T I E. That's the Scotty McClue, capital M, small c, capital C L U E. Pop that into your search engine and it will come up. Hilarious times, I think you do. Yes, absolutely. Now, the question we're asking today, should America come home to mama? Now, you'll just be getting up in the United States. You'll be a bit bleary-eyed. Ah, what's this on the telly? Scotty McClue, I'll call cable TV and get them to take your show. I thank you very much. I think they should. Tell them I can offer them 36,000 hours of live unscripted broadcasting and tell them we can talk about anything. If one of the American networks picks up Scotty McClue, everybody in the United States will never, ever look back when it comes to information, education, and entertainment. $36,000. So there we are. Excellent stuff.
Is that uh, what they're offering on the cable channels? I think they need to raise their game a wee bit if they were taking Scotty McClue. But as I say, it's a start. If it paid for the green card, then we are in business. Um, are you on this time every day? No, we just started yesterday. So you're actually witnessing the first of the big Scotty McClue shows. Normally we do Facebook Live on a Sunday night at uh, 10 o'clock or 2200 Greenwich Mean Time. So that will be about um, 7 o'clock, I know, about uh, 5 o'clock in American time. So there you are. But uh, we're thinking about coming on on a regular slot because of the reaction. It's very, 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 very popular. Scotty McClure is very, very popular. You've got 8,655 friends on Facebook. I have indeed. Yes, and uh, I don't think they'll let me have any more. Uh, sharing to everyone, thank you very much. Share, 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 share. Everybody look down at the devices, it will say, share this broadcast with your followers. Also, if you can follow me on Periscope, that would be very, very much appreciated. If any of you has got contacts in networks in America, then let them know Scotty McClure's about. Going to get cracking? Absolutely, we certainly are. Big style. So you're seeing the second of the big Scotty McClure shows live on Periscope. And thousands and thousands follow me. But here's the rub. Here's the rub, as we say. I only have 56,000 hearts. That's poor. Now, come on. With the best will in the world, somebody of the magnitude of Scotty McClure should have millions of hearts. Tally-ho, got to go. Dinky-doo, lovely to have you with us. Thank you for sharing to your networks. And hopefully the next thing is we'll be around. I have a Twitter account, yes, at Scotty McClure. So, small a, yes, the ampersand, capital S, small c, o, double t, i, e, Capital M, small c, capital C, L, U, E. Scotty McClue, all one word. So there we are. Excellent stuff. You'll see that. You'll pop that in and we shall pop up in America. Who knows? Scotty McClue may well be the next big thing right across the United States. Now, what we're asking today for those of you who are getting up in the USA, you'll just be wakening up and you'll think, oh, put the periscope on. What's happening here? Who is this guy? Who does he think he is? You're amazing, bro. I thank you. As if. So there you are. Thank you very much. Uh, so if we are the biggest thing in America, that's very good for America. Get in touch with President Trump and say, Donald, have you seen this guy? He can put you absolutely where you want to be. So there you are. Excellent stuff. Right. Uh, tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 that you're watching Scotty McClure. Tell them that we're live on Periscope Live, one of the world's great broadcast platforms. Send me more hearts. Tap, 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 de tap, tap, de tap, de tap. On your screens all the time, guys. And uh, what we're saying to America today is would you like to come home to Mama? Scotland is governed by the finest government in the world. Would America like to be governed by Scotland? Now, I know you've been independent for a good long time now, right? We don't dispute that, right? A good, what is it, um, 241 years. Is that right? Am I maths right? 241 years. You do the math. Anyway, 1776, you guys decided that. Now, I think Scotland could take you under its wing. At the height of the British Empire, India was saying to Scotland, because the world shares so much with Scotland, but not with England, and not with the uh, with the London government. And England, um, at the time, wasn't popular in India. And uh, I don't know what that's like now. But anyway, Scotland has always been incredibly popular. Scotland was all but running the British Empire for Great Britain at the time. So there were most of your top empire people were Scots. Most of the top people in the world are Scots, right? It's just an accident of birth. I'd rather be governed by Baba the elephant. So there we are. Then who we've got now? There's America fighting back. 
The Empire Strikes Back, I say. If you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, saying dinky do to all of you. This is our second Big Periscope show, uh, the lunchtime pop-up. And today we're asking, should America come home to mama? All right, now America's just staggering up, but um, spread the word. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Say, Scotty McClue is live right now. Lol, you must be the village idiot. The majority of Appalachian people are Scottish. The Appalachian mountain harp. I know that. I'm no village idiot. I think you are. In fact, I would go so far as to say to you, if all the village idiots in the world had their own village, you would still be the village idiot. Do you get it? Do you understand? I have a high, an IQ, a high IQ, a high Q, of 164. That I do not think is idiot level. Get that into your thick head, you dafty. Right, there we are. Sorry about that. Uh, rant over. Just telling him straight. Wow. Right, if you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, the world's top broadcaster, here just for you, saying dinky do. Get on to your periscopes as quickly as possible and share, 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 share. Hi. Hi to you. Scotty's back. Scotty is most certainly back. Dinky do. And remember, any idiots on here will get blocked on the spot. No use of foul language, no second names, any, none of that stuff. Right, I'm putting a bit of uh, extending the hand of friendship across the sea to the United States of America and saying, would you like to be part of Scotland? So there we are. Scotland is leading the world yet again. Every sort of two or three hundred years, Scotland takes precedence. How's America doing bad, though? We're the top world power. No, that's nothing to do with it. You're flapping in the wind. You're losing your identity. It's not a question of being the top world power. Gotta leave, but I'll bless this blessed day. Thank you. We're doing very bad right now in America. Yes, you are, and you're doing bad identity-wise. So just having the biggest stick doesn't make you the best person. Where does Mama live? Mama lives in Scotland. If you look at a map of the United Kingdom, of Great Britain and Northern Ireland, or Great Britain and Ireland, and you look at the top half, that's Scotland. It looks like an old lady with a backpack on her back. and uh, But it's far from that, of course. We are very much a young, vibrant country, even although we're ancient. So there we are. Ha ha ha. It's not Scottish. It's Irish, you silly goose. How I live in America. We're doing great. Yes. Well, when you say doing great, what do you mean by that? Is all of America doing great? Is America very proud of itself with the race riots? Right? Remember, there is only one race. This is my message to America. There is only one race, and that's the human race. And we are all members. And the sooner we realize that, the better. If Mama will help, I'll listen. Mama will always help. Bring America home to Mama. Bring America home to Scotland. So there we are. Uh, they reckon they've got a maniac running America. Well, no, I don't think so. You voted for him. So there you are. I'm American, but I love Scotland. However, I do not care. Uh, so there you are. Well, you need to care because we've got the finest leader we've ever had. Scotland has never, ever been so well run. Uh, so there we are. I live in America. We're not doing great. Charlottesville, ring a bell? Yes, we've been watching Charlottesville over in the United Kingdom. And I was appalled at the behavior to the statue. So there we are. What was behind all that? So there you are. Yep, somebody agrees with Scotty McClue. I think you all agree with Scotty McClue. Big style. Right, folks, can you get the message out there? Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Scotty McClue is broadcasting live on Periscope. It doesn't matter. Nobody listens anymore. I listen. This is interactive television at its very finest. I am changing the way people are watching television. Thanks for cheering me up, Scotty. We'll have to get back to work. We had one all right protest in Virginia 
Why is America allowed to do that? Uh, there should be no women drivers on the road, Scotty. This was yesterday's programme when we were talking about um, road safety. And we were saying that during rush hour, should we take the women drivers off the road purely for safety? Nothing sexist or anti-women or anything like that. Just purely for safety. All right. Get the message out there. Tell everybody Scotty McClue's here. Check out Scotty McClue. Get on to Twitter. Follow Scotty McClue. People were killed. That is not great. No, that is not great. I can tell you that. So, I mean, Charlottesville is America's shame. There's no doubt about that, guys. You're a legend, Scotty. Dinky do. I thank you. Uh, hello from Norwich in England. Ah, dinky do, Norwich. Lovely to have you with us. It's a huge shame. Everyone's entitled to opinions, and no matter what you believe, it's a melting pot of immigrants yes if you look that apart from scotland america is the most successful country in the world it's a uh, 99 immigration isn't it there you are i respect your opinion hello my name is khan hello khan dinky do to you my name is scotty mcclue and i'm broadcasting live just for you right across the globe Massive, massive Periscope broadcast. Now, when we finish the broadcast, make sure you share, 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 share. Share Scotty McClue. Everything with Scotty McClue on it, on the internet, you share it. America needs to fix the, the dairy and poultry industry. Amazing how that's produced. I'm 15 years old. Well done. Congratulations. Daughter of immigrants, a huge melting pot. You can buy eggs for 39 cents. I would like to come to New York City and put America to rights for you. Get me a television or radio network and I shall be there. That's why people flocked here in the first place, is to have their own ideals. Hey, I'm from Turkey. Dinky do. Welcome, Turkey, I say. Lovely to have you with us. All the countries of the world. How fantastic is that? 36 different countries watching Scotty McClue right now saying dinky do marvelous right any more points any more points on it because I know a lot of you it's lunchtime in uh, the western hemisphere and a lot of you want to get back to work but we can catch up real soon so there you are I'll pop back and perhaps ask the question again we love you I love you guys Mwah. you are absolutely beautiful love 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 from Scotty McClue saying